We're here at National Geographic's 50 Greatest Landscapes exhibition at the St. Louis Science Center. And we reached out to National Geographic to see if there was a good photography show that would fit with this really unique tunnel space that we have at the St. Louis Science Center. It's really a thoroughfare here, and so we want to provide something that people can look at as they go through, and they can also enjoy as they pass by over to our planetarium from our main building. The photographs in this exhibition are focused around all four seasons, so there are landscapes from all over the world that showcase what those seasons are like in that area of the world. So you may not be able to visit all of these locations, but it gives you an opportunity to see what these different seasons look like in places you may not normally get to visit. We also have cases with artifacts from our St. Louis Science Center collections which showcase the Four Seasons as well. So we did a tie-in with the different landscapes you'll see all over the world with things that are connected right here at the St. Louis Science Center. For this exhibition, we chose artifacts which relate to the different seasons. So we chose a symbol for each season, and then um, based on that symbol, we chose artifacts that either had that symbol represented on the artifact itself, or maybe it represented that symbol in some way. So if people were thinking about spring, for instance, normally they think about planting and flowers and rebirth. So we chose flowers to help represent that. In the winter cases, there are some objects from an expedition that Tom Horbein, a St. Louisan, did, and he climbed Mount Everest in 1963, and he is the first to scale West Summit. So we wanted to kind of highlight something that would be a familiar symbol for the seasons. So what you'll see here in these photographs, as well as in our cases with our St. Louis Science Center collections, are basically how different cultures interact with seasons in various ways. Our visitors have really been enjoying the National Geographic's 50 Greatest Landscapes exhibition. We see families come through and they each choose their favorite picture in all of the photographs and they'll take photos of themselves next to it, which is kind of a cool moment to see people interacting with these landscapes that maybe they won't get an opportunity to visit or maybe that they'll get to visit in the future and it gives them something to look forward to. Especially in a time when most of us are not traveling, we found that people are really enjoying seeing things from throughout the world. The Science Center is open, but we have um, limited capacity, so we're asking people to make reservations to come at a certain time. You can do that on our website at slsc.org. You can also do walk-up tickets, although we do recommend getting tickets in advance. But we do ask that people wear masks and they observe proper social distancing. Be mindful, give each other space, and things like that. The 50 Greatest Landscapes exhibition will be here at the St. Louis Science Center through the end of 2020. You can find more information on our webpage at slsc.org, and we encourage you to come see it. It's completely free and part of our general admission experience.